everyone, this is Shabangi from the ODOC team and today we are going to take a look at the Delta variant. The Delta variant first cropped up in India in 2021 as a result of its third COVID wave. Variants occur when the virus is allowed to spread freely, allowing it to mutate and evade the body's natural immune response and even the vaccine response, which is why stopping the spread is key in stopping the pandemic. The Delta variant is way more transmissible than the Alpha variant, but why is that an issue? If you start with just two infected people in one scenario, 10 iterations later, we have 40,000 cases. But in the second scenario, with the Delta variant, we have more than 500,000 infected cases. Alongside the usual COVID-19 symptoms, the Delta variant can also cause fatigue, muscle and body aches, headaches, sore throat, congestion or runny nose, diarrhea, and even nausea and vomiting. Data coming out from the UK shows that the Delta variant is doubling hospitalization rates in unvaccinated and young people. What about if you are vaccinated? A single dose of AstraZeneca or Pfizer will give you a 30% protection against showing symptoms, while double doses gives 60% protection via AstraZeneca and 88% via Pfizer. A recent study from Sri Jagannapur University showed that 95% of people who received two doses of the Sinopharm vaccine developed antibodies similar to people who were naturally infected with COVID. So, how can you stay safe? Firstly, by getting vaccinated. And secondly, by maintaining COVID-19 protocols like washing hands, double masking and maintaining social distance. It's only when we can stop the spread, we can stop variants from emerging. So let's do our part. If you have any questions regarding COVID-19 or the COVID vaccines, please speak to one of our on-demand GPs via the ODOC app. ODOC is by your side, always.